Hello everyone, I'm Raleigh White. And I'm Sophie Gorman. And welcome to today's edition of Art Talk with Raleigh White. So, for this show, Sophie has brought in her necklace. So with that being said, let's go ahead, get right into it. So Sophie, it looks like there's a ton of detail, a ton of attention, that you put into this piece. Could you talk about maybe what inspired you to do it? Well, it actually has a really dark side to it. So when I was little, I had a nightmare about these lions chained to the bottom of a swimming pool. And so that's really what inspired this piece. So you drew it from your own, your own personal experience. Wow. Yeah. So now, like I said, there's a lot of stuff that went into it. What were the steps and procedures you had to take? To get it done. Well, first off, it's a lot of drawing and sketching to make sure that I do not mess up cutting the pieces out. And I had to, this little ball in the middle, I had to put in acid so that I could etch a design onto it. And then I, every single one of these little chains I had to make by hand. So now, what were the designs that are put onto it? Well, the little dots on this piece represent water and then there's a little girl which represents me mm -hmm. in there and then there's some details on the lions wow. on their manes so that you get really that tribal feel or like oh yeah those are lions sounds like a lot of detail yeah what can what can others and even yourself what can you guys learn about this piece well i was definitely very ambitious with this piece and i think that can really help inspire other people. So if you have a good idea and you really believe in it, just go for it. Don't let time limits, don't let struggles or anything hold you back to something that you're very passionate about. Wow. Thank you for the advice. Sophie, thanks for coming on the show as well. Thank you, Raleigh. We will see you next time 